We're being asked to find the total differential of this function. Let's go ahead and work it out. So the formula for the total differential for a function of three variables is df equals the partial derivative of f with respect to x dx plus the partial derivative of f with respect to y dy plus the partial derivative of f with respect to z dz. So in this case it's pretty easy. Let's see. So df is equal to well the partial derivative of f with respect to x. Well the derivative of e to the x is just e to the x. So here it'll be e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared times the derivative of the inside. So this is the inside piece. We're taking a partial with respect to x, so we're treating the y and the z as constant. So we just get 2x. And then we still have the dx. Plus the partial derivative of f with respect to y. Again, we just get e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared times the derivative of the inside with respect to y. Well, this time x and z are constant, so the derivative of y squared is 2y, dy, plus the partial derivative with respect to z. So again, because the derivative of e to the x is e to the x, here we just get e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared times the derivative of this inside piece with respect to z. But since we're differentiating with respect to z, the x and the y are constant, so their derivatives are zero, so we just get, get the derivative of z squared, which is 2z, and then dz. We can clean this up, so df is equal to 2x e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared dx plus 2y e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared dy plus e to the x squared plus y squared plus z squared. And here I forgot the 2z, dz. Looks a lot scarier than it actually is. It's actually really easy to compute. I hope this video helps.